We are at a turning point in a pandemic that has now killed more than 300,000 Americans. The first doses of a COVID-19 vaccine arrived today in Georgia. The state says it now has more than 5,000 doses at the two facilities along Georgia's coast. Some public health workers got their first doses this afternoon with high risk patients set to be vaccinated tomorrow. We have some long months ahead, but U.S. Health and Human Services Secretary Alex Azar called this the light at the end of the tunnel as nearly 3 million doses are sent out across the country this week. It is a historic moment from the very first recipient in New York to Pennsylvania and Colorado. Cameras were there as healthcare workers got the first doses. It is a potentially life saving vaccine that the country's waited on for nearly 10 months. Secretary Azar says he anticipates doses of the vaccine will be widely available by February or March. But that's a long way off, and right now we are still waiting to see when the vaccine could arrive here in Atlanta. Our Joe Hinkies looking into it. A Georgia Department of Public Health spokeswoman tells me Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine is not expected to arrive in Atlanta until Wednesday. Today, though, more than 5,000 doses arrived at state health department offices along Georgia's coast. This white package was wheeled into the offices of the Coastal Health District of the Georgia Department of Public Health today. Inside and between insulation and dry ice are thousands of doses of COVID-19 vaccine now being stored between negative 70 to 80 degrees Celsius. The nearly 6,000 doses received from pharmaceutical company Pfizer will be used to vaccinate health care workers and residents of long-term care facilities in Chatham, Glynn and other surrounding counties. Knowing that we have the vaccine, that we are really beginning to distribute it to those at highest risk and those that are putting their lives on the line every day as they care for people with COVID. It's just phenomenal. Dr. Lawton Davis, director of the Coastal Health District, said a small number of frontline state health department workers would be vaccinated today, and a larger number of vaccinations are expected to begin on Tuesday. We are preparing to deliver vaccine to our staff within 24 hours of receiving the vaccine on site. Christy Norman is the vice president of pharmacy services at Emory Healthcare in Atlanta. She says when Emory receives the vaccine, they will begin registering their healthcare workers for time slots and then vaccinating as many workers as they can based on the number of doses they receive. And we'll expect to receive vaccines in small quantities over the coming weeks to months. The Georgia Department of Public Health tells 11 Alive later this week it expects the FDA to authorize a second vaccine for use from Moderna. If approved, the state anticipates shipments from Moderna can begin arriving next week. And the COVID-19 vaccine comes with several possible side effects. Coming up at six, I will let you know the side effects that a doctor with Emory's School of Medicine says you can monitor from home and the side effects that you should call your doctor about.